In the South Valley, a random act of kindness, and it's all caught on camera. A five-year-old boy once again has toys to play with after his family lost everything. It began with a burglary and ended with a knock at their door. On the other side, a Kings County Sheriff's deputy and some hope. AJ Cotto sat down with the family tonight. And AJ, this deputy went well beyond the call of duty. Well, Alex, on this family is going through a lot right now. A loved one was just killed in a tragic accident, and they lost all their belongings. They say this surprise reminded them there are still good people out there. Hey, look who's here for you. Deputy Troy Smith showing up on the doorstep of five year old Julian Ramirez. The visit itself, not the only surprise. When he showed up with the toys, my son got happy and he seemed. New toys. Action figures, a small gesture, but a big impact on this family getting ready to move. They had stored all their belongings in a storage facility. They had been burglarized and all their stuff had been taken. Including all of Julian's toys. Deputy Smith responded to the call. Mother Nancy Ramirez reached out a few days later saying Julian keeps asking about his toys and sharing more heartbreaking news. Her father in law killed in a tragic accident. Smith says he had to do something. I guess it broke his heart hearing that sad news. So he asked what kind of uh, toys was it, and I told him Avengers. And he said, what well, was his favorite one? And I told him Spider-Man. So Smith went shopping, showing up with new toys, including Spider-Man himself, not expecting his act of kindness would be caught on camera. Um, I just felt like it was the right thing to do and just try one ease some of the pain for that family. Ramirez says it gives her hope. It means a lot. It means the whole world to us. It, it shows us how there's so many people out there that are really good. Thank you so much for that. I really appreciate it. For Ramirez, the gift was more than toys. It was a real life hero. And Smith says he never expected any attention from this. He just cares about the area he grew up in and wants to bridge any gaps between the community and law enforcement. In studio, AJ Cotto, KC24, Local News, That Matters.